streets in America, and he is very good at competing against others of his kind. So much so, he's heading to New York to compete for the most coveted title in the dog world, Best in Show. Fox 32 Scott Schneider was in Aurora today to meet Mateo Scott. Yeah, that's right. You may not know what to look at him, but Mateo is gaining a reputation in the ring as a force to be reckoned with, and he is just one step away from canine immortality. Pete Matteo, who in just two weeks could become a household name. The Spadoni Italiano has been making a name for himself in competitions all over the country, and he's heading to New York to compete in the Westminster Dog Show, the Super Bowl of competitive dog events. He's going into Westminster as the number one Spadoni in the country. Um, we are actually almost 100 points ahead of the next dog in the competition. When he's not competing here in Chicago and around the country, Matteo's owner slash dog mom, Lindsay Stanton, says he leads a pretty normal life. He loves a good chew toy as much as the next dog, and he loves to take your dog to work day. But don't let Mateo's playful demeanor fool you. In the ring, this dog has been a dominant force since he was just six months old and is currently ranked number one in the country in his sporting group. And he's loved competing from day one. Each time he went in the ring, he won, so, and he just loved it. I mean, he was like strutting, and he won a toy his first time in the ring, which you can clearly tell he likes his toys. Outside of the ring, competitive dog owners are often asked to describe describe their dog's personality. With Mateo, what you see is what you get. They have a very clownish side, even though um, I think they're one of the most soulful breeds. You can almost see into these guys' soul when you look in their eyes. And he knocked me over good. By the way, the 140th Westminster Dog Show kicks off Monday, February the 15th. Guys? Scott, thanks. Go Mateo!